aging fetuses 100 to 120 days old using a ReproScan XTC. Exam 1 is a 100 day fetus. Here we're on the hind end working the probe towards the head and we're trying to get the best head diameter, the largest head diameter possible. And here we are approximately four centimeters based on the grid for 100 days. Let's take a quick look at trunk diameter. Some people use that. Again, about five centimeters for 100 days. In exam two, we have a 110 day fetus. We will try to get the largest, clearest head diameter. There we are at approximately five centimeters for 110 days. Exam three is a 120 day fetus. Here we'll try to use head length to approximate the age. The screen is 12 and a half centimeters at the widest point. You can see here then we're approximately 10 centimeters for 120 days. Exam four is a backwards fetus that's approximately 120 days old. Sometimes it's tricky to get the probe down to the head and about with a backwards calf. Gather as much information as possible to approximate the age. Rely on previous experience. We'll work our way down to try to get a trunk diameter. Here we are approximately nine centimeters about three quarters of the width of the screen. In exam five, we'll look at another 120 day fetus. Here we'll try to get an idea of what using eye diameter is like. Eye diameter is mostly used on advanced pregnancies around five to six months. Here we have a 1.5 centimeter eye diameter for 120 days. Let's see if we can't get a head diameter that's a little more repeatable and much more commonly used. Here we have a pretty good head diameter and it's about half the screen for six squares, six centimeters. To obtain a fetal aging chart, please contact ReproScan through the website www.reproscan.com and please visit the YouTube channel. Thank you.